Hey guys, what's going on? It's Mitch, or Beige and Canadian, and today is Saturday, Saturday, nah, there's nothing for it. And uh, my food and drink, let's see, food and drink, well, I don't have any, because I am in a small-ass hotel, and uh, the reason I'm here is because I'm actually going to be moving this summer at the end of summer, so I'm going to be leaving my natural habitat of Canada, and coming back down to the States, and I'll be living in Pennsylvania for, I guess, until I finish off high school, and then off to do other great things but not really probably not and uh, so yeah my food and drink I don't have any because of that although I do have water but it eh, doesn't really count too much so um, I originally was planning on doing some Minecraft adventure maps today but for whatever reason I can't record it because whenever I click record in fraps the frame rate just tanks and there's nothing I can do about it so we are on Terraria Terraria which isn't bad so uh, character choices we've got bo 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 and uh, those of you who have no idea who that is, it is a old anime character who basically has a giant yellow afro and he fights with his nose hairs and he has like a little son who's his sidekick. It's a, it's a really fucked up show, but it is hilarious at the same time. And I've also got Papa Smurf down here, Papa Smurf. And uh, I think I'm going to go with Papa Smurf today. And I've got World as Yay, sure. I haven't even played this world, I just made it a little while ago. That way I don't have to generate a new one because it does take, eh, it doesn't take too long. It takes like, I don't know, 30 to 45 seconds, which isn't too bad, I guess. So uh, Papa Smurf is starting a new adventure, but I do have some items on it because those of you who saw the the Terraria Parte over on Awesome Sauce Films, you know that I was playing as Papa Smurf and uh, the items carry over from what you have in your inventory, which is, it's pretty neat. It's a pretty neat feature that I guess is rather helpful so you don't have to keep starting over completely from fresh unless you really want to then you just make a new character or just ditch all your items and make a new world I guess but I uh, I don't feel like starting over completely fresh but this is more or less fresh because I don't have much and I still am pretty clueless as to what exactly I'm supposed to be doing in Terraria I know that it's just an awesome 2d side-scroller adventure game where you just make up your own world do your own thing but I don't exactly know how to do everything just yet, so this is still a learning experience for me. And that's what that's what makes video games more exciting to me, is when it's a learning experience. And uh, so now I have a story for you guys. Last night, I went to uh, my dad's friend's house for a dinner. And I grabbed this dip. This delicious, it was absolutely amazing, this delicious salsa bean dip. But it was fresh out of the oven, super, super hot. I put it on a nice chip. A nice uh, nacho chip and I didn't want to take it out of my mouth because I felt that would be rude so I had this burning hot fresh out of the oven salsa dip in my mouth it completely completely just torched and seared the roof of my mouth and I had a nasty like weird mouth blister as I completely get owned by that slime not paying attention there but yeah so I, I've got like this this nasty thing I, I, I pretended that you know I'm like you know what I'm gonna do this I'm gonna man it out I don't want to be rude and like kind of spit this out of my mouth at, at this dinner so I'll just keep keep chewing it pretend my mouth is a freaking thermos that didn't work out too well for me so I think I think the better idea would just go with what's <laughs> go with what's gonna be better in the long run <laughs> be the rude person at the dinner and just spit it out that was a terrible story I know so I'm gonna kill this slime and the zombie before I die again Jesus Christ I'm going to die again or not take that zombie I have a sword why am I using this I don't know the sword's kind of annoying because you have to keep clicking to swing it whereas this I just hold it down and it keeps going it just mows them down for me so and I have another story <laughs> completely connected actually this is on I'm being serious I'm not sarcastic it's actually completely related to that uh, same dinner story my parents decided they were gonna go have go ahead and have some asparagus I was gonna have some but then there was like egg on it it was like some fancy I don't know I, I, I wasn't I wasn't interested in having this eggy asparagus so I didn't take it luckily and it turns out my parents got food poisoning from it so that's pretty chill and <laughs> in the middle of the night Oh god, this is just filthy. Th there were some certain sound effects happening in in certain in the bathroom. 
<laughs> there was a lot of, uh, and then there was some. <laughs> it was fucking disgusting. Oh man. So Papa Smurf is on the run. I am dodging that zombie. I don't want to get killed again. I need to get some more shrooms so I can get my grub on. There we go. And what do I want to do? I want to find some... St I need to set up somewhat of a house. So I'm actually going to get killed on purpose. So that I spawn at my spawn. Because that's... So it's helpful. I don't know how to... I think there's a way to change your spawn in this game. I'm not sure if you can only do that in the multiplayer or not. But I don't know how to do it. Oh yeah, yeah. I'm stupid. There's a way to change your spawn. It's actually really easy. It's just you take... You make a bed. Which is pretty simple. So I'm going to do that. Oh well. I guess I'm not going to do that here. But I'm going to figure that out. I'm going to get a glass of water. My mouth is a bit dry, and it's, like, freaking in pain still. Because my mouth is not a thermos, unfortunately. And yeah, my setup for doing this is pretty cramped, to say the least. It is extremely cramped. Because I've got this tiny little... It's not even supposed to be a table. It's a chest drawer thing. It's a side table for your bed. And I've opened the drawer... Not the drawers up, the cupboards up on it so that my legs can go somewhere. It's... You know, you work with what you have, and you just go with it. And I found a shooting star! Nice! I don't quite know what that- I know it regenerates your mana, but I don't even know what my mana is. I know it's for, like, magic stuff, but I haven't done anything like that. So I'm just gonna explore and do stuff. And it looks like I found a lot of pot. And not the good kind, unfortunately. And I found a zombie, too. That is not a very nice zombie, either. Put down a torch. Yeah. And start slapping away. I hope you guys can't hear the clicking. I've rearranged it so my mouse is behind my microphone, so hopefully it's not as obnoxious this time around. But I've got a feeling it still is. And now I need to get back up there. Jump. Jump. How am I gonna do this? Oh god, the zombie's coming for me. Jump. Jump. Oh no. Can't see. I want to get back up there and collect those pots. Let's make some more uh, wooden platforms. These are actually so useful. You just put them wherever you want to go and they can they, you can place them in midair and it actually helps a ton. Wrong thing. I want to lay down a torch so I can kill this stupid eye if it comes near me. Come here, demon eye. Stop being such an eyesore. Haha. <laughs> Seriously, get over here. Papa Smurf needs to teach you a thing or two. There you go. Get out of here. No one loves you. And I failed. There we go. Clear this out. And collect some pot. You know you like your pot. What I get, what I get, what I get. I got bombs! Oh, dang! And I spilled the water. Yeah. Outed my torches down here, and now there are zombies after me. They do not look too happy. And why is there a torch down here? I don't even know. Whatever, I'm gonna venture to the end of the freaking universe, and then I'm gonna make a bed, if possible. Anything down here? There's more pots. Can I smash them with this? Oh jeez. What'd I get? I don't know. <laughs> so, what do I want to do? Because this is, this is probably starting to bore some of you. You guys are probably all yawning and like, God damn it, Mitch, why are you such a freaking boring person? Well, I'm, uh, I'm hungry, and when I'm hungry, I lose a lot of energy. <laughs> I am starving right now, I'm not gonna lie. But there is nothing I can eat as of now because... There, my parents, my dad doesn't have any cash to give me, and he is sick and in bed, so I am just waiting until he gets his ass out of bed so that we can go get something to eat, which could be a while. So yeah, I'm trying to just pass some time, have some fun, and hopefully not piss you guys off. <laughs> um, Alright, Papa Smurf, what are we looking for? This looks like a heart-shaped rock sort of thing, and I... I'm failing. Dang it. No. No. Thank you. 
Does this sort of look heart shaped? Yeah, it does. Definitely. Found some more pot, too. Nice. Dig this out so I can actually get up here. Quick before the hyena come. Dig a tunnel, dig, dig a tunnel, dig a tunnel, dig, dig a tunnel. I love that song. If you haven't already noticed. <laughs> what did I get? No idea. What is up here? I should collect all this stuff. It's actually going to come in handy because I'm going to need to make... I know I need to make a furnace. I need to make a workbench, obviously. I also need to um, make a... Uh, whatchamacallit? Uh, an, an anvil. And I can start crafting some stuff. I believe there was nothing down here. So I need to make a couple more of these wooden platforms. These really do come in handy. Because I can just do this. Jump. Jump. Oh god, the zombies are coming. The British are coming! The British are coming! No! Uh, yes! Oh, cool! I can cheat! And save... And just walk normally. That's a... Aw, oh, crap. I didn't cheat that time. And it's a dead end. What a waste of planks. Oh well. Um, I'm gonna kill you, zombie. Wrong thing. Sword! He's gonna kill me! <laughs> Actually, I want him to kill me. Kill me. Take me. Oh, shit. Then you lose your coins. Forgot about that. Oh, well. There goes a gold coin. NBD. I probably should not have done that. Oh, well. Because I would like to start setting something up here. Or explore the other direction. Because I have a lot of materials and... Yeah, I need to make a house. Screw it. I need to make something. Or make a... You know, I'm just going to make a workbench. And then see if I can make a bed... Let me see how this is going to work out for me. Let's see. Because if I can make a bed, then I can just venture wherever I want. And then, um... You piece of crap eyeball. I didn't want to do this. You brought this onto yourself, Demon Eye. And now there are zombies coming too. Now I can't craft. Thanks a lot. Stay away. I don't want to die. I'm too young. Papa Smurf is pretty freaking old though. There we go. Give me your copper coin. How much health does he have left? It's got to be close. Did he just really run away? Wow, those eyeballs are pussies. They ditch as soon as they're going to die. I guess that makes sense, but still, come on. Go up there. Let's see, can I make a bed? Because if I can make a bed, I'm just going to run and venture wherever I want and place the bed down. Silk. Here's silk. So I made two of those. Can I make a bed with that? Oh, dang it. I guess not. I wonder how much of it I need. Or maybe I need wood. Wooden. Oh, I don't know. And now there's a lot of things coming for me. Oh, they're just slimes. And they're probably going to kill me anyways. Back. Back, hell demon. There we go. I actually need to kill these guys and get their gel. I could use a bit more of that. Oh god. I am way too good. Yeah, can I respawn, please? You know what I'm going to do, guys? I am going to take a break. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And uh, I'll be uploading a lot more Terraria, as you can tell, because I've got time to kill. And Terraria is a load of fun, so Papa Smurf will be back soon enough. I'm going to actually just read up on how to make a bed, see how much resources I actually do need, and I will see you guys all there.